Hello everybody and welcome to your next SFML tutorial. So in this tutorial we're going to be learning about something fairly easy to do as we're going to be putting custom mouse cursors in your, in your game. Sometimes in your game you know you want to have some fancy mouse cursors or something or you just don't like the default one. So I'm going to be teaching you how to import a custom mouse cursor. Now this is fairly simple. So we, we're going to take the uh, the code from the last tutorial and in the, uh, we have our mouse click function everything's the same so what we need to do is we're going to right after you make the window we're gonna say window dot show mouse cursor and we're gonna set it to fault so we're not gonna show the default mouse cursor so basically I'm um, creating a custom mouse cursor is kinda like an illusion what we're gonna do is we're gonna display an image um, that will replace our mouse cursor image so or it's gonna be shown in the position where the normal the mouse will normally be and then it will display it then so we set the mouse show mouse cursor equal to false and then we're gonna create an image so we're making an image called cursor and a sprite and call cursor sprite we load our cur whatever image that we want to use as our, as our cursor and then we set our sprite uh, to that, that cursor image. Simple enough. So once we do that, uh, after this function or before whenever, we're going to set our cursor sprite dot set position is equal to window dot get input dot get mouse x and the uh, cursor's uh, position and the y coordinate is going to be window dot get input dot get mouse y. And then at the bottom, right before display, we just do window dot draw and we draw a sprite, and therefore we will have our cut our custom mouse cursor. So if I run this program, if you look right here, I have my custom, I have my custom mouse cursor. I can move it around; it replaces my regular mouse cursor. So and if you click it, it will still play the music the same. So everything works efficiently so that is it for this tutorial thanks for watching hope you enjoyed this and bye